Hello everyone and welcome to Vlogmas Day 4. Yeah, I'm sorry I missed um yesterday, but yesterday was really busy. I was kind of literally going from one thing straight into the next, so, and I was quite stressed, so I didn't really get a chance to pop my camera out to sort of film what I was doing. And um, it's kind of a similar sort of feeling with today, but with today, it's just that I haven't really been doing much apart from doing essays, which I have now finished, thank the Lord. But the only thing I've got on is a work training thing tonight, which I don't feel is really worth getting my camera out for. So I just thought I would just do another sort of sit down chat video for today. So I was thinking about what I wanted to talk about and I thought maybe I could just do a bit of a reflection and roundup of the events of this year. Not gonna lie, 2019 has certainly been oh, quite a challenging year for me. Uh, I had to, I was going through anxiety which I've spoken about a couple of times in videos on my channel and I had to take a lot of knocks which took a lot out of me but I went and I did therapy, I finished that, I, I started on medication, I've now come off that but even though this year was sort of challenging, what I sort of want to take from it but also to keep on a positive level because that's much, much healthier, is to say this was a year of growth and hopefully in the future, I'll look back on this year and go, oh my God, I'm so glad that I went through it because it's made me much more stronger, much more resilient and it's shaped the person that I am. <sighs> so what? else has been happening this year um I think what I want from this year I feel like from this year I am sort of much stronger as a person and things that have happened like the way that some people have treated me over the last few months has kind of made me go hang on a minute I'm not happy with that and it's made me reaffirm my morals and values and how I expect to be treated by people so that's something I'm hoping to put into 2020 where hopefully I'll be treated a bit better or I'll be sticking by my, my morals and values even more because expectations and standards are very, very important. And also, I really hope that I'll be, hopefully I'll be a bit happier because 2020 is an important year for me because I'm going to be graduating from university which is absolutely well, sort of terrifying and a bit and exciting. When I came to university they did say to me that the year was going to go by really quickly. I didn't quite believe it but here I am. But even though there have been challenges this year the good things that I have had have been like really, really amazing. One of my favourite, favourite bits from this year has got to be doing the RSC summer school where I met loads of amazing people and every time I look back on it and how we all bonded so quickly within five days just feels really sort of amazing and I came away with lots of really great memories like seeing backstage of the Royal Shakespeare Company where I really, really hope to work one day and also meeting um, the actors as well. I loved doing The Ace Face, which was a show I did back in June as part of the Goldbagen Kian's 60th, oh no, not 60th, 50th anniversary celebration. So that was the first time I'd been cast in a show in my second year because unfortunately, in the other terms, I didn't get cast not gonna lie, when those happened early on to year, that really, really hurt and it did take a lot out of me. But I ended up finishing second year on a high because of that show, which feels really, really good. For my birthday, for my 21st birthday, I got to go and see Wit Witness for the Prosecution and I ended up having a very small role in the play because me, myself and my mum paid to have jury seats and I was lucky enough to sit 
in juror one's seat, which meant that I got to read out the jury's verdict. And I received lots of wonderful compliments from the audience members, from audience members and actors alike. So overall, in a way, I'm sort of glad that this year has been a year of growth, but I really hope that I can let go of the bad and the hard and move on from here and just make the most of every single good thing that comes to me in 2020. So to anyone who may have also gone through this year, you know, might have had a hard time this year, I would really advise just look back on it and be glad that you managed to come through whatever it is, you've made it this far. You may still be on the journey, but you are on the right road and there are lots of people around who are going to support you and are gonna make a huge, huge difference and think about the positives that you've had and just smile. Thank you guys and I'll see what I can do for the next Vlogmas video. Bye!